Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily reading. Today it is the 25th, but you know, the timing is fluid, so keep that in mind. This may or may not resonate today, may not resonate at all, may resonate whenever. So let's see what kind of message we have for today. This is for somebody who needs it. I don't know who might be you. It's about foundations. I think it's about building a foundation, you know, starting or working on your foundation, something like that, building a foundation. Investment. <sighs> mm, starting over. Yeah. Starting over. Starting fresh. Stepping, you know, into unknown territory, perhaps. You know, or maybe somebody is in unknown territory and they're in the process of building or rebuilding. Um, yeah, somebody has, uh, it looks to me, I feel like somebody has gotten out of a situation or they've been relieved of a unhappy predicament you know they've gotten out of an unhappy situation and it looks like they are in the process of rebuilding their abundance I think a relationship went south okay a relationship went south and now it's like somebody is starting fresh. Maybe they've relocated, you know, moved to a new place and now they're starting to reap some rewards. We have a, uh, we have a new potential here for something big, okay? New potential for success. Somebody is manifesting something bigger and better, is what I am trying to say. Yeah. Mm, interesting. Yeah, somebody has broken free. I mean, the Ten of Wands reversed with the Ten of Cups reversed. Somebody has broken free from an unhappy situation something that was holding them back something that was burdensome something that was really heavy somebody it's like they have dropped the load it's like the load has been dropped the heaviness has been dropped and it's like now they're beginning to realize the potential And the reward for starting over, it's like now there's a reward coming for starting over. There may be a, some financial constraints, or there was, there was some financial constraints, but I, I feel like that's over with now. I think those financial constraints are in the past. And, I, and somebody is really... Um, Letting go of the past with the Six of Cups reversed, okay? Somebody is letting go, starting over, starting over. It's like releasing the past. There's still a lot of memories, though. There's still a lot of memories there. But somebody is beginning to realize that I don't need to, you know, be alone. I don't need to um, beg for anything from the past, you know, I don't have any desire or energy to focus on the past, to focus on the, that lack that I, I had been in. So somebody is really giving up on that victim mentality, 
and really deciding to start over. This is like the very beginning. Somebody is really investing on or in. Somebody is really, really investing in new potential. Of course, to our moment, this is this is change. You know, big, big, big change, fated change. Maybe you never saw it coming, or maybe you know this could be on the way. Something could be coming that you didn't expect, and you know it actually could be a good thing because it's right under this Ace of Pentacles. Somebody could you know have went through a very troublesome, heavy, burdensome time. You know, with, I don't know, somebody from their past. Somebody that, you know, they have a lot of memories with. Somebody went through a very troublesome time. And now, this is building a new foundation, okay? When the tower crashes, you know, when the, when, the, when the ship rolls downhill, when it all comes crashing down, the only thing you can do is rebuild. You have to rebuild from the ground up. Including a new foundation. If the foundation is cracked, you need to build. You need to put in a new one, right? You need to build a new one. So I, I really feel as though someone is in the process of rebuilding, starting over. It's like the universe stepped in because this burden was so heavy; it was too much. It was. It was way, 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 way too much. Um, it's like now somebody is seeing the light. They're seeing the light about the poor decisions they've made in the past. It's like somebody has received some sort of wake-up call that there is so much more anyway. There's so much more than that. There's so much more than this. There was a lot of uh, discontent in a relationship. There was. But I think whatever somebody was holding on to, it's starting to be released. It is. It's starting to be released. It's like somebody's making a conscious change to rebuild. And this, I mean, the Ace of Coins is a gift. It is. It's a gift. Somebody could be receiving a gift of something bigger and better. You, you, definitely. So whatever came crashing down, whatever upheaval that has been caused is bringing you something bigger and better. If this upheaval has not happened yet, for many it has, right? Be prepared. Be prepared. And don't be scared of it because it's going to allow you to start over. It's going to give you a fresh start. And I have to tell you, this looks like it's letting go of the past. It does. It's, 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 it's letting go of the past. It's letting go of the baggage. It's, it's just like starting fresh, you know, starting on a new journey. I really feel as though somebody is, is giving up that old victim mentality that I have to stay stuck here. Universe, universe is, is helping. Some, some, not much. Okay, yeah, the, the tower is a universe card, but it's there's only one major here, or two, we have the fool. So yeah, the universe is saying, it's time to start over, so we're gonna, we're gonna rip this away from you so, so that you do, okay? That's what that's what this is. The universe says we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna bring it down so that you do start over. So that's what we got here. We have a fresh new start that is coming courtesy of the universe, right? Universe is helping you. Um To start with a clean slate. At the end of this suffering, there's a reward. But you have to experience the upheaval to get the reward. It's just, that's the way it goes. 
It's been ten of, ten of Swords on the bottom. Completion, 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 completion. The worst is over. Somebody has been through a major difficult period in their lives. Very, 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 very difficult. Very overwhelmingly difficult, okay? It's been painful. It's been stressful. It's been too much. The, 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 the thoughts and the memories and the... Uh, fear of betrayal or the betrayal whichever it was feeling defeated that's over it's over it's over the worst is over I'm here it is the worst is over because at the end of all this you're going to receive a bigger better opportunity but you had to go through this pain and that's life but this is the end it's the end of a painful situation it is I feel like, I feel like the storm is over. I really do. I do. Mm. The high priestess reverse. Somebody hasn't been listening to their intuition, right? Somebody hadn't been listening to their intuition. They hadn't been um, believing, perhaps, believing what they were hearing. But it's like now, now they know that they deserve more. I think the period of repression that someone has been in, served them well. It did. Somebody was going through a repression. Somebody was just secluding themselves, you know, perhaps because they needed to do that to heal or to release or to let go. Anyway, the Six of Pentacles is about give and take. It's about getting what you deserve. It's about allowing people to help you and helping others as well. So I really feel as though somebody may be receiving some some help from somebody else as well. There could be somebody that is helping you to see the light. They may be helping you to... Um, redirect your energy. Somebody has really lost the, or had, let me say had because it's connected to the past. Somebody had went through a repression, went through a period of serious lack, low energy, um, no desire, no drive, no ambition. Um, no, no confidence, no vigor. It's just lost their shine. Somebody went through a period where they just felt Maybe they went through an unhealthy period. Now, obviously, that's what this is. Somebody did go through an unhealthy period of, you know, clinging to the memories, clinging to the past, clinging to the pain. But that period is over because of the tens. Tens are completions. And it's like now, it's like maybe somebody has come in and they've offered support or you've received some sort of payout or you've received some sort of gift from somebody or something has been received that is helping to alleviate some of the stress, some of the, some of the pain. Um, I think help has arrived. That's what I'm trying to say. Help has, arri help has arrived. Could be a new partner. Okay, we have this Ace of Cups. This is love. And then this is right next to this other Ace. This is a, we have a, a new potential um, emotionally supportive connection here. That could lead to something long term and solid. This is this is a new beginning in love. Now this could be self love. It could be you know I'm going to love myself again because that's what I deserve. Somebody could also be receiving 
you know, or coming into contact with somebody that, you know, there will be equal give and take. This won't be a one-sided relationship. It's, it's a, you know, a relationship where two people actually work together, you know, and it's not just based on one thing, okay? It's based on love and abundance, right? So it's, it's based on both. So I feel like somebody... <laughs> has been through some major upheaval in their life, but this upheaval needed to happen so that somebody could get what they deserve in regards to love and abundance. So I really feel as though change is here. Big, 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 big change. The change, perhaps, that you have been waited for, waiting for. If you have been feeling like you were left out in the cold, if you have been feeling like, you know, you're less than attractive or you're not good enough or whatever, I'm here to tell you that there's a great big opportunity waiting for you. It's right here. It is right here. And there's an opportunity to... To start over, but you're gonna have to take a risk because with that fool, you always gotta take the risk. You gotta replace that fear with faith. So, you know, I really feel like there's an opportunity for love and stability here after somebody has let go of a very painful, stressful situation. I mean, they have. And it's like now you're getting what you deserve. Let's get an oracle card. You want to? I don't know. I don't know which deck to use. Somebody has a new opportunity, period. New opportunity for love and stability. Could be with the Scorpio. Could be with the Aries. Could be with anybody. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio could be with anybody what I'm trying to say this is an equal opportunity okay it really is this is like equality it's like what you give is what you get with this person it's like an ideal partnership too it is it's an ideal partnership because it's it's not about one thing it's about you know it's about love but it's also about stability it's also about security we have a new opportunity for love here. We do. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Yes, it does. Oh boy. You deserve love. You are lovable. You are lovable. So, you know, I really feel like today is a day of starting fresh, starting over. Taking baby steps, perhaps. Investing time and energy. Um, taking a risk, you know, stepping into the unknown. You know, probably getting to know somebody new after losing your, your faith, losing your desire. You know, being in an unhealthy state of mind. I feel as though that time is over and it's a, there's an opportunity to build a new foundation that could lead to um, something really beautiful where there's, you know, a lot of love, something stable, solid, secure. I mean, it, there's a potential for something beautiful here. So to build a new foundation, period. Somebody is building a new foundation. They deserve it. This is what you deserve. So I don't know who this reading is for. I hope it's for you. I see that somebody is... I think following their heart. Because they know that they deserve. Good luck. <laughs>